Hello everyone and welcome to my YouTube video on YouTube. My name is Kevin Foster. I like new videos on YouTube. And this one I got here is a um, Nintendo GameCube uh, USB controller which can be used with your um, Dolphin emulator on your computer. And um, you can connect it with a USB. So all you do here is open it. Hang on. Open it here. like this it has a um, this is the actual um, it's not a Nintendo brand it's from another company but to get the actual Nintendo um, it's gonna be hard to find on Amazon you might can get it on eBay or Craigslist or Facebook market store um, it's called a GameCube controller it's a, um, a thing for um, where you can run um, GameCube emulation games on your PC and it can connect to the um, computer so um, yes it, it installs a driver when you connect the USB to the USB port here on your laptop so um, I get this thing called um, Dolphin emulator where you can run um, Nintendo GameCube games on Dolphin emulator you can always you can oh, you can use the Wii too on you can play Wii games on Dolphin emulator just download the Dolphin app um, go to the um, Dolphin um, link and click on it and you can download it so um, let's open it here so this is the controller comes with as it's uh, looks a little like this. So it's the cord. What was the recent emulation game I downloaded? One Dolphin Mario Party 6. I'm gonna open this here. Sorry. Let me just uh, open it. There we go. So you will definitely need, um, well, you can hook this to the actual GameCube console if there is a way that you can um, um, connect it in. So just take off this wrapping here. So we just, um, so this is the cord. So I ordered, I also ordered a, um, a sensor bar with a USB. Hopefully it works on the Wii U. So, um, so you connect, um, this to the, um, computer and it's going to install a driver to, as you, um, put it on so um, this is the controls here the shoulder buttons the Z button and you can play with this with most emulator um, GameCube games on your PC um, um, it shows you what to do on um, Amazon or how to do it so um, you just take off this thing here that is attached
You mean do I have the sixty four bit or that? I have the um. I have the x eighty six bit. Yeah, I will probably have to look for a um later on. Um, a sixty four bit version of the uh, um, emulation for Dolphin emulator. So um, this is the thing. You connect it to the computer right here. Put it in here like this. Okay, let's turn on the computer first. So before you ins install anything a device with a USB port, um, you might want to turn on your computer first so you can read it. So uh, once your computer is turned on, you wait for it to boot up, and um, you put in this um, controller in. So it doesn't say the brand name. Windows sign in window. It's from Air Force, Star Force, or whatever the name is. It's a different company. Um, well, you can try and get the actual Nintendo. Um, brand controllers but now it's hard to find and um, remember if this won't work on the Wii U but I can try um, if I have a win uh, um, it, um, there's a way for the Nintendo Wii U to play um, Ninten Nintendo GameCube games on the Wii U with only the Wii U gamepad um, but um, you have to have Nintendo and I'm trying to get Nintendo but um, we will have to uh, um, I have a computer buddy that can try help me with that so um, Nintendo is a thing that you can use for playing Nintendo GameCube games on the Wii U but here we, we here to talk about dolphins so um, so you log into your computer first hidden, 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 hidden. welcome and then um, well, let's connect the HDMI to the um, TV here so we can use the TV where is the connection to the there we go so it's gonna connect to the television so the sound and audio and everything and video is gonna be converted to the TV so um let's turn on the uh tv here oh hold on like it's dead what is my spectrum remote oh, i can't find it let me just connect this You may be asking you can play mostly all the Nintendo GameCube games on the Dolphin? Yeah, you can. Um, well, I don't want to go crazy and download too much because <laughs> um, okay, Let's charge this up so we can um, Start. Okay. Okay, let's turn on the TV here. input so you can change the input which is this button right here um, hold on here oop, oop. HDMI too yeah and this is usually for the spectrum receiver I better put it back 
because it belongs on there. So, um, so this is the uh, the Nintendo GameCube controller. Well, it's, it's not actually from Nintendo. Nintendo don't make them anymore. But they're making them for the Switch. They have a Nintendo Switch version. And it's the actual look of the controller. So, um, so this is what installs. So, let's close this Microsoft Narrator crap. I don't know what for you to put that on. <laughs> okay, so... Um, as you know, when using Dolphin Emulator, remember to remove some programs that you don't need because it can take up space. Yeah, I know. I got the wrong one. It's an x86. It's supposed to be an, um, an x64 bit. So, um, 64 bit, yes. Because if I stick with this x86 bit too long, it can... Um, use up more memory on this computer because this computer is a 64 bit and um, there are 32 bit versions of Dolphin but it will be a lot of slower process as you use Dolphin so so first you plug into the controller you don't use it yet or it reads the driver and don't press anything plug it in Okay, for some reason it's not reading. So, um, let's reinsert it on the other end. Let's put it on the other side. Oh, don't fit. What's going on here? Hang on. So it might read the controller, it might not. So what you have to do is go in your um, device manager, click on start menu, control panel, go to device manager here so um, let's try reinsert it again try C so let's see if it's device manager so maybe you might have to restart the computer in order to this controller to read because in order to run it um, you will have to, um, you get portable devices, processor, software components. Okay. Storage controllers. Let's see here. Let's see Microsoft. Um, Intel R USB 1. Point, host controller 1.1. 1. 1. I don't know which one is that. One is for the card reader when you install SD card, root hub, and everything else. So system devices. Let's see. Okay, let's try and see if it starts. If for some reason it's not reading, because you see, you 
you were here on noise on here um, on the um on the um icon here it would try switch it on the other side okay it's not reading on that one Let's try to see if it will start. So let's open up um, Dolphin and see if we will read the controllers. Keyboard and mouse is V. So it's not reading the uh, See it's set with the mouse pads with the keyboard so we will have to um So I don't know if it's going to work. <laughs> Let me try something here. Open. Is the remote? Don't put the TV too loud. Okay, let me try restart the computer and um, take this out and see if it will read. Okay, hold on. So I'm going to try restart the computer and see if it will read. So. Yeah, so this is the actual controller. That you can use for dolphin so let's hope it's working okay we just wait till it restarts so.
We're waiting for this thing to work. I don't know if it's gonna. Gotta restart it. close this Okay, it's kind of stick out. You want to make